Hi, this is Richard Byrne. In this video, we're going to take a look at how you can use end screens in your YouTube videos. This is the replacement for YouTube annotations, which is going away at the end of April. So let's go ahead and take a look at how to do this. First of all, I'm logged into my YouTube account. I'm going to go into my channel. Now let's go into my video manager and find a couple of videos that we want to change the end screens on. So what I want to do is I'm going to have this video here, how to add music to Google Slides. That's going to play at the end of my video about using Google Drive videos inside Google Slides. So let's click on that video and open that one up too. So now I have how to use Google Drive videos in Google Slides open here. And let's go ahead and select End Screen and Annotations. And now let's go in and add an element. And so we're going to select Video or Playlist. And now we're going to choose a video. And I'm going to choose this video here that I've already selected. I'm going to grab that, website. Why not? grab that URL and let's put it right in here. Now obviously I can also scroll and search through my existing uploads but I want to link to that one. Create that element and we can now go in and specify when that element will play we can move these little sliders and specify when we want that to appear on the screen or not appear on the screen. And yeah, we can see it right there. So that's how you can add end screens to your annotations or as a replacement to annotations in your YouTube videos. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or practicaledtech.com.